We made it to the top. Hey, to the top. We made it to the top. Hey, to the top. <laughs> It is time to bless the food. Everybody bow their heads. Just let me see. Keisha. Let me see it. Keisha. You're strong. Keisha. Let me Keisha. Okay, it's cool. Father. Hey. Spicy. Spicy. Making wrist icy. Yeah. Bitches money and making making hope. There's nothing wrong with being an okay bitch. What? what? As long as you're not a basic bitch. <laughs> We are the chosen ones, bitch. Hey. Oh, 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 oh. Never have I ever stolen a boyfriend. Sorry, Quinta. It was Dre. Who cares? He had a Flintstone dick. What is a Flintstone dick? Yeah. You had to use your feet to make it work. Ew. All the hot girls make it pop, pop, pop. Bad bitches with the bags say, ay, ay, ay. If he ain't talking about no money, tell him bye, bye, bye. And if you see a mad hoe, tell him ha, ha, ha. Hey, don't get mad, ho. Are you willing and able to assist in case of an emergency? But No, I'm sorry. I, just, I need a verbal yes. You're yes. Not. Yes. Yes. I will relocate you both to middle seats in the back seat if I just don't get a verbal yes. Yeah, yeah. Don't get mad, hoe. Get mad. Get a bag, hoe. Wow. Get mad, you guys are all my ex-boyfriends. You'd like me to leave. You know, I'm done with dear white people. Is this some Black Mirror shit? Everybody's acting so different from the traits they previously established. You guys used to care. People still care, but people change. If everyone stayed exactly the same, life would be tedious and predictable. Like a third season of a Netflix show. Yikes. You're listening to Dear White People with Joel Brooks. Same title, new spin. So the show's gonna be a little different with your girl. We're going to touch the major issues both political and pop cultural. Hunty, it's after Labor Day. What are you doing with all this wine? What, is that problematic? Yes. That's problematic. I'll have guests who know all about the Supreme Court and guests who think the Supreme Court is a Diana Ross-themed drag race challenge. Listen up, you bougie mother. Okay, bitch. This is the deep end of the gay pool. You still got your little floaties on. What you need to do is begin every sentence with trigger warning. You know, no one showed up to Black August today. Reggie's all booed up. Uh, Sam's checked out. I guess I really don't know what to do. <laughs> Reality, I need grits. Coco's on a world domination tour. I feel like pre-Sasha Fierce Beyonce. Perfect! In every way, yet still not good enough for the relentless white masses. You just gotta lean in. I'm guessing her people came in on a different ship than ours. <laughs> Jeez. What? Where's the lie? She white, right? Whoever told you life would be comfortable... Lied to you. Sometimes you just need to grow up and accept that you're I see you've been watching closely. The Order is more powerful than you will ever know. You must kill the narrator. Okay, no more Scooby-Doo mysteries. <gasps> Unless I can be Daphne. Lionel, you're Velma. That tracks. We're all in this together. The only voice you need in your head is your own. Kill the narrator. Close your eyes and go to sleep. You're all going to die. Violent, horrible deaths where only your dental records can be used to identify your charred corpses. Okay, the townspeople are out of pocket. Mm -hmm. Think moonlight meets sex in the city, but boiling over with all the tea. Now. Will you be my queen? <gasps> no! The people are in a panic about Hades. Every time we open the barrier, we're exposed to danger. We can't risk having another villain escape. Well, if it's the scepter and the queen's crown have been stolen. This sleeping spell spreads throughout Oridon. We're trying to discover which villain has perpetrated this evil. <laughs> the only thing more powerful than the curse of the scepter is Hades' ember. I'm supposed to protect Oridon. I felt all of my power slipping away. 
Unless I get that ember, it's game over. You shouldn't have come here. People's lives are in danger! This is a job for pirates. I need that to break a spell. Can you confirm Marisol Ramirez recently stayed here? Quiero volver a cruzar. No creo que la segunda vez va a ser más fácil. Y menos con ese bultito que traes ahí. A partir de aquí, nadie habla. Entendido. Sweetie, you're safe now. Where am I? Where is she? The little angel is sleeping. You're in America now, the land of plenty. We're so happy to have you. This place is so special. Yeah, I think I could call it home. Problema. How did I get here? I can't remember anything. People dream of a place like this. Nothing in this place makes sense. I know you must be very confused right now. Give her to me. No. <laughs> get me We're not paid to give them the American dream. We're paid to keep them out of it. forgets Mother's Day. Yeah. Buy me some bath salts. Is that so difficult? I would like one Mother's Day card. A candle. Something. At this stage, it doesn't feel like motherhood. It feels like otherhood. That is the best description I've ever heard. What are we gonna do? Drive to Manhattan? Storm their apartments? No. Nah, we gotta let them individuate. Blah, 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 blah. Except it's Mother's Day. We're not on vacation. We are on a mission. We are going to reconnect with our sons. Don't take no brand. They can love you. Mom. Mom. Surprise! Hey, Mom. <laughs> Boo. <laughs> you didn't call me on Mother's Day. I texted you. I birthed you. They can deal with having us in their homes for a few days. They were in ours for 18 years. It's like you're living in Gollum's cave. Mom. Are you cooking? You want to meet me after work? I have a party tonight. Oh, a mother's invited? No. I mean, no. We're in the middle of New York City. We are going clubbing. I didn't go clubbing when I was supposed to go clubbing. Would we even get into a club? Well, I didn't think I'd get any of these jeans. Look at me now. What is that move? Twerking. <laughs> you know who you are without me. But I need to figure out who I am without you. <laughs> this big, bruised, beautiful thing, this is your life. I'm not going to tell you what to do. Since when? Since today. You taught me there is room in every story for a better ending. You will always be my mother. Thanks, Mom. You know how long it's been since I had sex. I was gonna say pizza. <laughs> Football is emotion. It comes from the heart. It crosses all barriers. <laughs> you play football anywhere? Football can actually help bring communities together. This is an amateur football country. Going to the World Cup was unthinkable. But these guys, they have something in them. The real excitement about football it isn't always the best team that wins the game. Leo Messi, he was not the tallest, not the strongest. Nobody could imagine that he would be the best player of the history of the football. Right, that's genius. When I was 12 years of age, doctors told me I've throat cancer. 
But in my hospital room, I never got sick while I was watching soccer. So I became South Africa's youngest professional referee. This love, this involvement of the whole country, it comes from your guts. You don't refuse to pass the ball because someone comes from a certain place. You are going to pass the ball because you want to win. That's my dream. In our country, we have dealt with so many challenges. This means everything. It's not only about sports. It's shown us what we can do when we work together. Being a wife of a driver is an adrenaline rush. Lifestyle is insane. It's definitely a hierarchy. Everyone's clawing to be on top. I might as well just get in a tiki hood. There's so yeah. much shade. May, August 3rd. This is Jake Terry. I'm a Sunshine Sandler. I hope my next foster is as wonderful as you. Sunshine looks so good. You took great care of her. Danica McKellar and Mark Declan star. You want to go for a walk? In a <laughs> Summer Nights all new original movie. If there's one thing I learned while I was deployed, it's not to wait for holidays to celebrate life. Enjoy the moment. Yeah. <laughs> Love and Sunshine premieres Saturday, August 3rd at 9 on Hallmark Channel.